we're uh, doing a 73 Z1 paint job, just how the factory did it back in the 70s. Uh, except I've kind of primed and blocked and smoothed everything out, uh, or the factory kind of just started with colors right over bare metal and plastic. Uh, First step is to paint the tank and tail white for a base, mask it off uh, so you can get it down to where the orange stripes go, it's going to be white, where the brown is, it's a black. Uh, the next step is going to be uh, A silver flake in a clear Kawasaki called it uh, silver flare pearl but it was really a real fine metal flake uh, they did everything in lacquer back then kind of doing this project I do a lot of them in lacquer but this one's done base coat clear coat urethane for durability Did a little wet sanding just to clean up the edges between the black and the white. Uh, cleaned everything off. We're ready to shoot uh, the mid-coat flake on it at this point. You can kind of see the mid-coat flake. It's over the black and the white. Uh, shows up a lot better over the black. Uh, that's, you know, one coat. Probably do about three coats on all the pieces. And show you the final uh, look in a few minutes. Uh, here you have the three coats of flake on it. Kind of hard to see, comes out a little rough because it's flake. Uh, the flake barely shows up over the white, but out in the sun you'll be able to see it even with the, the candy over it since the candy is translucent. Going to mix up uh, some candy and uh, shoot a coat of that to show you the transparency on it. That's the first coat. You can see it's getting a little color to it, and I'll uh, show you the final product uh, shortly. Three coats of candy orange weren't quite enough. I shot four coats, get the color right, even though. I don't know how it's showing up in the camera here, but it's real life. It looks correct. Uh, 
Still needs a lot of clear buffing and it'll uh, go through all the processes and look great when it's done. Fluorescent lighting also isn't the best way of looking at the colors. Outdoors it'll be about, about a lot better looking. The uneven uh, thickness in the stripes between the cap and the neck are just how the factory did it. They kind of narrowed up the brown stripe so they have room to get all the stripes in there. <laughs> 